good morning everyone and welcome to today's video today is travel day um it is literally like half past four in the morning and we're heading off to the airport so we can go and get checked in let's go That's it, we've arrived, we've bailed out the car and we're heading in there. Right, made it through security, got checked in, left the luggage. Now we're in duty free. Just give you a quick overview. You know what's in here. Alcoholic beverages, Oak flight, there it is. 740 to Farrow, that's where we're going. We can relax for a bit. Oh, AU vodka, 29.90, not bad. Absolute vodka, only 14.09. What else we got? Obviously, you've got all your perfumes over there. Oh, Robin just wants to look at these watches. Which ones do you like? That one. That one's nice. Should we go and have a look at some perfume with Nanny? She's just there, look. <laughs> Nice. Yeah, I'll have a bit of Tiffany. Oh, a bit of Tiffany and Co. So you've got all your makeup and everything. Watches. And we're going to head through over that way in just a second. Uh, so we're heading this way now through the sunglasses. Yeah, a bit of a ban. Can't beat them. 300 quid for them ones, St. Laurent. Oof. Oh, Ted Baker. You want to look at the kids' ones? I mean, I don't know if you need sunglasses. We've got some in the case for you. Here, look, the mirror's here, look. You look snazzy. <laughs> Come on then, let's take them off. I like it. Yeah, they are nice, but they're £25 and um, you've got some in the case, so. Hold my hand then. Good lad. There we go. Ooh, two for eleven ninety nine. that's not bad. What, you don't like Harry Bows? Gummy bears? Mmm. Massive gummy bear. Massive gummy bear. Right, now we're going to head out. Right, so when you're through East Midlands, you've got a Starbucks, uh, WH Smiths, and the Boots is just there. And you've got a JD. Some seed tin just there as well. We've got an accessorise. Um, I don't know what that shop is. Traveller? Oh, it's Jack Wills. And we've got... Um, proof. Proof 65 there. All clearly signposted as well. Gates 1 to 5 just there. And we've got Burger King. And upstairs there is um, a bar. Just serve food. And then there is also a smoking area upstairs in the East Midlands Airport. But we're going to go down the bottom and go to Frankie and Benny's. Because that's what we fancy today. So I'll check you with you when we get to Frankie and Benny's and we're sat down. Right then, we are sat down at breakfast. Um, the lady did let us know as we came in there was a 45 minute wait uh, which is fine for us because our gate won't be called till 7 and it's only 6 o'clock and it doesn't take us long to eat so that's good um, we did have to go up to the bar to order so I just thought to show you the little menu that there is uh, mum's had a sausage cob and then we got in the dark we did leave in the dark didn't we it was dark when we left home yeah and then these are what you can get if you want something a bit different. 
I've gone with the pancakes with bacon and maple syrup. And then I forgot to show the kids' menu, but I'll put a screenshot in of it now. Um, it was pretty decent kids' menu, to be fair. Um, so, yeah, I'll pop that in now. Right, so food's just came. This is Riley's pancake. It's not a bad size, actually, for a kid's portion. I mean, they put it on a huge plate. And I get the chocolate. Yeah, and then chocolate sauce. Then we've got the toast. This is my pancakes with bacon. I'm so excited for that. And the sausage cob came with chips. <laughs> just just a random random breakfast chip and sausage. Right, that's it. We've done breakfast. Now we're just chilling. I'm waiting for the plane. We've got about 15 minutes until the gate's called. And then we can head down and go and get on the plane. So yeah. Are you excited, Robin? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right, that's it guys, there's the plane. I'm so excited. Yeah, big one. Can you see it? Are you excited? Yeah. We have to follow this little path all the way across there and all the way across there and then get on the plane. And we're getting on at the front. We're in rows six and seven. So we can't wait. Yeah, we're getting on the plane. Right, that's it. Got on the plane. Robin next to me. <laughs> Got the tablet. Um, I'm going to take off. Um, the windows are a bit fogged, so I don't know what footage I'll get of us taking off. But I'll see what I can do. But we're going to go now. A new place, a new home For a while, let me feel alive Nothing to hold me back Take my time, just enjoy the ride A new man, passing by Life is good, best I've ever felt Get me up, so new Somewhere I can find myself
Onto the little bus, yeah. about to rape little Robin up. She was to sleep. And we're just on the bus. It's raining, ish. Right, made it on the bus. We are now heading over to our hotel. It says that it should take about 45 minutes to get to the first hotel, and then will be stops after that so that's going to be fun uh, but it didn't take us long it only took us about 20 minutes to get through security over the side we was one of the first off our plane though so take that with a pinch of salt the queue was very very long um, but it didn't take long to move through like I say we managed to get through in about 20 minutes that wasn't too bad I've just got little Robin over here with me and little Riley over there Riley's asleep by the looks of it already <laughs> um, but yeah, so we're heading over to the hotel now. I'll let you know when we get there. the reception area it's nice it's very nice it's a four star hotel that we're staying in give you some more information about that in just a moment i right, go get checked in first we <laughs> yes we can go swimming soon right we just got to the room so for this one you do have to put the key card in the holder um and you come straight into a bathroom. I like the fact that it's double sinks. Big mirror. Obviously toilet. There is a bidet. And then it's a full bath with um, shower. So it looks great. Robin will be very happy, won't you, to have a shower. There we go. And there is some little benches here that you can put your suitcases on. And then you've got two single beds, a double sofa bed. The kids have been chucked over on that. Um, and then there's this big wardrobe. The doors do close, but I've left them open so you can see how big they are. And you've got storage, lots of drawers, cupboards. You do get a complimentary free bottle of water, which we've moved and put in the fridge. Um, another cupboard, TV, remote, and then I'll just quickly take you outside. So we have our own patio, just two chairs, but that's fine, so we won't really use this a lot. And then straight down there is the pool. And obviously, as you heard right at the beginning, Robin is very excited to go swimming. So we're going to look at doing that in a little while, but we're going to go and get his bearings first. 
have a walk around the hotel, see where, where everything is uh, and just go from there to be honest. Right then guys, so after a rush in, we grab some food. Um, I showed you the room tour, we've just done that. And now this is the lobby. And I will say, it's a beautiful lobby. It's a nice view. It is a nice view as well from the lobby, through these windows over there. Um, and there is elevators. Yeah, there are some good Halloween decorations. Robin was a bit scared when she first walked in. Uh, but we're gonna have a quick look around this shop that's actually inside the hotel and just see what they've got. So it's open from 8.30 till 10.30. It's got bracelets, sunglasses. I don't think you need new ones. Bags? That would do as well, to be fair. That's the water thing. You you suck the water up with it and then you shoot it at people. Maybe maybe another day. Yeah, not today. Not today. We've got a ball. We've got yeah, a ball, ball to ball. The beach. I like that they sell their own flutes. Although the pizza is thirty-two. They're seventeen twenty. So that's not bad. Oh, that is kind of cute. Nineteen fifty for that. Oh yeah. A couple of toys. A couple of toys. Some key rings, some fridge magnets. Oh look, shot glasses that say Portugal. Oh and a nice oh that's quite a nice but it's not bad for sixteen quid. That is not bad, it says the Algarve on it too. I like that. And I've got bottles of water, Kinder eggs, a bit of chocolate, some Coke cans, gum, sweets, a couple of Algar posters, some crisps. Oh, might have to do a bit of trying of them. Oh, they they like bacon flavour. They've got bacon on them, so I might have to try that. And then some frozen drinks, and then up there we've got some essentials, we've got some nappies, some sun cream and bits like that. Oh, and they even sell cigarettes. So yeah, not bad at all. Right then, we've come down to floor one, to where the pool is, and we've just found the activities board. Um, what day are we on? Monday. But there's a show in Palmer Club, but not till 10 o'clock. It's a bit late. These are what they've got on. Oh, Wednesday night, DJ night. DJ. Show, live music. Yeah. Interesting. Oh, sucks. To be us. We're not here on Saturday. We're only doing a Monday to Friday. But yes, we've come down to floor one. Uh, it's bright, I can't see. I've got the sunglasses on so I can see. Um, yeah, we've come down to floor one, which is where you get access to the pool, the pool bar, um, and so on and so forth. Our room's one of the rooms up there. Couldn't tell you which one, other than it's on the seventh floor. But yeah, we're going to head around to the pool. So there is some outside toilets just here. So you're having to go all the way up to your room. Just have a look around first. Oh, they've got the activities and the kids' activities up there today, so that's not too bad. And this is obviously the bar. I'm sure I'll be enjoying a drink in a little while. And these are pools. The pools are quite big and you're allowed floats in these pools, which I think is awesome. Um, plenty of seats around at the bar. And we did see there is plenty of seats available just behind the hedge. There is grass areas with um, loungers on, so you can lounge on there, which is really good. So there is some showers outside here, should you need to uh, 
show yourself down before going in. Like I say, plenty of seats available out here at the bar area. And some in the shade, which is nice. Let's go this way. We are going to go in the pool, Miss Robin, just once we've had a little walk round. She's already in a swimwear, bless her, and that's all she's talked about. We told her we'll go in as long as she's good. On this little walk round we're going to do, I will try and do a um, full hotel tour. I just don't know when. <laughs> um, but hopefully I'll be able to do it um, and I'll put it up um, throughout this week's stay or at the end. Um, we'll see. There's a little park here and there's a sports pitch. I see some guys are playing football. Come on, Miss Robin. I'm going to the park. I'm sure that Nanny can let you have a little go on the park. If you want one. So we might have a little montage of them playing on the park now, guys. So enjoy that. Well, that was fun on the park, guys. Good news. It's in the shade. So, it means the slides are never going to get hot, which is good. I don't know. Oh. What does it say? Do not let people in. Oh. That's good. I like that there's a sign on here. There we go. Yeah, it's quite a big area. That's the leisure area. So that's where the other restaurant is then. <sighs> Come 
from them? Okay, that's shot. And up the stairs we go. Oh, so these are the fancy restaurants. So you do get to have one meal at one of them. Can't remember which one, but it would have been on the sheets that I put up earlier. There's nothing there. But that is the way to all the specialist restaurants, not the other buffet. The other buffet is underneath. Oh, is it? But yeah, you can see, look, there's plenty of loungers on the grass available in the shade and in the sun. Loads of seats available. This is all outside dining. Yeah, oh, blind again. Back in the sun. Okay, let's have a look down here because this is where the slides are. Well, going down this way, come on. Oh, wow. Check that out, guys. And there's the slides too. Quite excited. Yes, I'm going in the pool. She's funny. Huh? Are you excited or what? Oh, is this the kids' outdoor bit? Oh, very good. That goes back into the hotel. So this is the kids' area. They have kids' clubs and everything, which is nice. Does look quite cool. So this is where you can drop your kids off if you want. Open from half ten till twelve. And then also three till five. Every day. We're going down. We're going down apparently. All right, chill out. I bet it's cold water and all. This does look to be the busiest side, I would say. Yeah. I mean, there's them ball things on the water over there. I mean... Robin, please go into the concrete. Yeah, don't jump. Case you fall. Yeah, definitely the busiest side. If you want to see it over here, I advise coming over in the morning. Oh, Pringles. Pringles. Two euros for Pringles. Oh, yeah, look, there's the kids' area. Well, let's walk around it. So I've got a couple of little slides here. I'm sure Robin will be dying to go on. Some sprinklers, some really little slides. Yeah, pretty awesome. Oh, some showers over there. Obviously we're gonna have a walk up here. So we're just having a walk around at the minute. There's the pool rules. Pause the screen if you want to have a look at them. It's all the usual stuff, no diving in and so on and so forth. And then, oh, screaming children. Oh, Curtis Lodge. Um, and then obviously if you go down this way, if you walk somewhere through here, which we are gonna do, leads you down to the beach. Now the sign is over there, um, it's a bit torn off but you can just make out beach at the end so that way to the beach. So yeah, that is pretty much everything, I'm not showing obviously the food, we'll show that later and if I go to the bar, I'll show you the bar too. Oh right, okay, so you've got to that gate and you've come down there around and that's how you get out to the beach.
So yeah, cool. Right, we've made it back round to the pool, and here she comes. Are you having a drink? Is it nice? What is it? What flavour is it? I don't know what flavour it is. It might be orange. Lemon. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, so no wonder she likes it. Here's Riley in his trunks. Oh, there she goes, jumping in. <laughs> oh, dear me. She's in the water. Is it cold, Riley? No. You're good, are you? Go on then, and you get. Oh, there's the little steps there. Robin just chooses to jump in. <laughs> Got my first beverage. Just went with a standard Malibu and Coke. Found out that they've got pink gin, uh, Gordon's pink gin on the all inclusive. I'm very excited about that. Uh, there is self service for your soft drinks um, and they do do slushes. The blue one wasn't ready, otherwise, I'd have got one of those. Um, but the lemon one is, and Robin's loving that, so that's all that matters. And they're having some fun in the pool, so I'm going to leave them to have fun in the pool. And I'll check back with you in a bit when we move on or do something else. <laughs> right, we found the snack bar, guys. It's literally up the path from the pool. But they've got lots on breakfast bits. They've got toast. They've got a toast machine. Got drinks. They've got like pastries. They've got fruits. And then they've got a hot bit down the bottom with hot dog sausages, which Mum's bringing me my bun for. Uh, burgers, grilled cheese. Yeah, it's not bad at all, to be honest. Not bad at all. Just thought I'd show you a sneak of the gym. I'm not going to put too much in, but there you go. You can see the gym. But that, that's, um, I thought the elevators were this way. So come out the snack bar. I'm going to just show you where it is so you, you've got an idea. But we literally... <laughs> walked up this ramp here which leads down to the pool so it was dead easy and then we go in this way to the elevators so yeah I'm gonna go back up to the room now and uh, chuck Robin in the bath <laughs> she's wearing Riley's t-shirt because she's got a bit cold so Riley didn't he's not bothered so into the lifts we go Right, so the buffet was a little bit busy. I will try and get some clips a bit later. But I just thought I'd show you what I've got. I've already had my pizza, so I do apologise, but it looked like the one that my mum's got. <laughs> um, got some pasta, some duck rice, which sounded really nice. A kebab thing and a bit of pork. Robin's got some tomato pasta and she did have some of the um, white pasta that I've got. Riley's got chips and a piece of chicken. And then mum's gone with the two pastas and some pizza for now. But yeah, we'll try and get a, a bit of a run round of the uh, buffet. There's quite a lot on it. A lot of different choice, which is really good. However, we have found they don't seem to do chicken nuggets. There weren't any at lunch and there's not any now. There is, um, like I say, Riley's got like a big flat chicken. But no, no, no chicken nuggets yet or no fish, like fish finger bites or anything like that. We'll see. We'll see as the week goes on. So I just thought I'd show the food. So they've got a stone-baked pizza oven, which is why the pizzas are so nice. Um, yummy. But they've got soups to start. So we've got a chicken soup, and then we've got a vegetable cream soup. And they've got some little, I forgot what they're called, like croutons to go in there. Then we're moving around. We've got some onion rings and some... Tempura vegetables. Uh, moving on, we've got some like drizzles, some lemon for the fish. As well as some fish here. We've got some hake fish, some tomato sauce, and then some salmon at the end there. So right, coming around here, we've got obviously your uh, Brussels, and you've got some squid, which I thought was onions and gravy. So I'm glad I've now read that. And obviously you've got your French fries, slash your chips got some courgette and then you've got some uh, plain rice then you've got your meat a bit of gravy oh yes then we've got taters carrots chips and some duck rice which was yummy i had that on my plate so here are the pizzas i've just been and put my plate down so i can run back up and show you what's left pizzas are so nice and like i say because they've got an oven pizza it looks amazing and they've got some pork 
from like kebab type things, mixed skewers. And then your pasta options, which is your, your pasta bolognese. And then it is mushroom sauce. And oh my God, that one is so nice. So, so nice. But that is it. I'm going to sit down. I'm going to enjoy my food. I'll show you the salad bar and things after. So I just thought I'd show you the kids section. So they do have spaghetti, some mince, potato things, the chicken things that Riley had, and obviously chips. So this is the little kids corner they've got. Then, this is like the salady portion. Got some cheeses, some crackers. And then along here we've got all different variations of like mini salads. Then your bog standard salad that you can make yourself. Got some olives, some little mini onions and then some more salad bits around this side then over here we've got desserts which is what me and robin have come for so we've got a selection of nice fruits there a bit of pineapple melon looks good we've got some cakes over here they all look very yummy and some pots of yogurt and stuff through there too we're going to dig in oh and they also have ice cream on offer right at the end so we're going to dig in i'm very excited Robin, how is your yoghurt and your chocolate cake? Is it yummy? No, don't put it on Riley's. We've saved Riley a bit just in case because we took the last bit of chocolate cake. So we, we don't know whether there's going to be any left. So we've broke a bit off for Robin because we don't think she'll eat it all. And she's popping some yoghurt on her chocolate cake. Beautiful. Is it yummy? Is it yummy? Yep. Mm. Eat it nicely then. Me, I just went with a bit of a light offering today. I just got a piece of watermelon and a piece of pineapple. Because I did have a lot of food food. Um, and I did fancy heavy cake and I had ice cream at dinner. So, I just went with a little bit of fruit this evening. Um, and then I'll be ready for breakfast tomorrow morning. Because you know what breakfast is like for me. I love a good bit of breakfast. I'm quite excited to see what the offerings are. So, I'm going to leave you with that. Robin's enjoying her yoghurt. And... Um, catch up with you in a little bit after we finish tea right that is it we're not doing any more literally we've come back to the room we've got into our dramas and we're going to bed it has been one hell of a long day being up since four o'clock has killed us off the kids are going to bed now just put the telly on we're gonna relax so we'll catch you in the morning with a new vlog which will be next week for you guys so thanks a lot for watching and we'll see you next week bye like, comment, subscribe. I'm coming. Bye. Bye. Bye.